all have music that we love, music that we dance to, and music that we sing along to. But do we know what it takes to come up with a song? Basically, the process goes like this. Uh, the singer sings. And then the producer looks for the tempo. The tempo is the speed. Then after that, uh, the producer does the drum programming. That's where you use computer software to create the drums. And then later on you start adding all the instruments one by one. And then the singer sings and then the song is done. The soft-spoken artist also highlights the importance of being flexible with all music genres. If you look at countries in the first world or countries where music is a, is a much bigger industry, uh, you find that a hip-hop producer is just a hip-hop producer. For example, Dr. Dre is simply a hip-hop producer. You never hear about uh, bands like Coldplay who play rock music uh, being produced by Dr. Dre. But in Zimbabwe, uh, a single music producer has to be versatile. You have to produce Sungura like Boto Nyamondera. You have to produce Ama Piano like DJ Tira. You have to produce dance or beat like um, Chill Spot. So um, you are expected to do quite a lot because uh, Zimbabweans have got a very varied uh, music taste when it comes to genres. On the rather obvious but tricky question of what comes first, money or one's reputation, Mono had this to say. Many times uh, we have to record such people. We told you, is a very slow song, <laughs> but to do it in our way, you need the money. So thank God uh, for technology. We have um, uh, pitch correction software, we have got uh, auto tune software. So you can play around and um, make a donkey sing. And um, the only problem comes when uh, the person has to do a live show. Because live show, I know so much. Mokundu, who has worked with various artists, including the late superstar Oliver Mtsekuze, is the man behind several hits, which include Alexio Kawara's Karioaka, Amara Brown and Ja Prazer's Kure, Derek Mpofu's Chiskana Changu Zimbabwe, and Mweyawechi Zimba, which is only rock not, Colette Msanyera, ZBC News, Ararim.